welcome to Bright Society, I'm Laura and this is Rebecca. Today we're bringing you some inspiration for thank you gifts for parents of the bride or groom on your wedding day. Because um, sometimes it can be hard to think up gifts so yes, we are here to help. There is a Pinterest board that accompanies this video, so the things that you see popping up on the screen will be linked in the description box below so that you can easily find those products. So the first thing we're gonna start with is a simple card. So you can get personalized um, cards either off the shelf that say parents of the bride, parents of the groom, mother of the bride, etc. Or you can even go one step further and get it personalised with their name. Mm -hmm. And that can give you the opportunity to just write a heartfelt message to them to give on the day. And obviously flowers are generally a big part of a wedding day. And so you can kind of incorporate that into the gifts. Um, so you could get something like a rose, um, or it could even be a reflection of what was in your wedding bouquet so for example uh, this is something I did so I had peonies in my bouquet so I gifted my parents who are keen gardeners uh, a peony plant so again year on year they could be reminded of, of my wedding day and something else that along those lines that could continue in the future is a floral subscription service so you can get um, different variations on lengths but you could so a bunch of flowers can be delivered to them after the wedding at regular intervals so you've got some they've got something cheerful in the house to remind them of the wedding day yeah gift that keeps giving yes um or again on the on the flower plant range you could get something like a personalized crate or like planter uh, for your parents garden again just a little subtle reminder that's there all the time or maybe something slightly more traditional you could get um, father of the bride or groom a pocket watch mm -hmm. so this could be engraved and personalized for them it could be something that you want them to incorporate into the outfit on on the day itself but then it's again it's a reminder they'll always have a time on them <laughs> <laughs> but also you could have a little message on there as well like remember that time I got married yeah. <laughs> um kind of on a jewelry type theme maybe a, a locket um or bangle with an engraved message on the inside uh, for the men or, or women in your life? Or you could give them a photo frame. Now, you might want to wait until after the wedding to give the actual photo to put in the frame, um, but you could give them something and kind of give them a warning, this is what this is for. And I know you did something for your wedding. Yeah, so I gave, on the day, I gave my parents a very kind of quite ornate photo frame that was uh, like a twin photo frame with like the hinge in the middle. So for to indicate that the photos to be put in it is sort of one from their wedding day and then a sort of matching moment from our wedding day so which turns to be like sort of them signing their um, registry and again so there's a matching one from each day sort of side by side in their house now and I was quite looking at I always enjoy looking at that when I go <laughs> around as well you could also get like a personalized trinket box or a sort of memory box uh, for either party, kind of get them again with messages on or sort of a photo transferred onto the top to make it kind of extra personal. And again, down kind of the photo personalization route, you could have some ties customized, probably more for the men, um, where like on the back of the tie, so it won't be seen by everybody, mm. you can maybe have like a family picture, like you and your father uh, or the father figure. Uh, on back there, so it's just kind of a special, like, like from when you were little yeah. or something, or when you were a baby. It's like a special thing between the two of you that you both know is there, but not it's kind of not broadcast to everybody else, and it's just yeah, yeah, an extra special thing to be wearing. Yeah, I like that. Uh, you can maybe get commissioned a piece of sort of illustrative artwork. Uh, there's quite a few nice ones out there now, like particularly aimed at sort of wedding in the wedding market, which you can have ones where it's sort of like the back of you all in the family or ones of the outfits so you could have like your wedding dress next to your say your mother or the bride or whatever you know what outfit she's wearing that kind of is sketched next to it so there's sort of side by side with a little bit said underneath 
things along yeah. those lines that obviously can be savoured and uh, or put up around the home. Yeah. If your parents are big tea drinkers or coffee drinkers, you could get some personalised coasters that say father of bride, parents of the bride, with the date on. You could also get sort of personalised like tote bags or bags of some description for maybe each of them. Um, that could be the gift themselves, it could contain one of the other gifts. If you know they're into a particular hobby or have specific interests, you could obviously choose something, it doesn't have to be wedding related, uh, get something to do with that hobby. So, it, I mean, I, for me, my dad is into model railways, so I got some bits and bobs for his model railway layout. Um, or maybe you, you want to give him sort of an overnight stay somewhere with a voucher for the restaurant or something like that, so they can have some sort of special time away. And if you're getting married somewhere maybe out of your local area or some people having to travel or a destination wedding, something like that, you could put together a little hamper of gifts maybe local to that specific area, especially if you're getting married somewhere that's meaningful to you. So you could have things like local honey, local beer, just bits that are kind of specific to that place. Yes, I like that one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's kind of a bit of inspiration for your gifting. Um, we hope you found that helpful and um, if you're looking for any of the products that we talked about they will be in the description box below and also over on our dedicated Pinterest board and again the link to that is in the description box. If you like the video please give us a like, hit subscribe and we will see you next Friday. Bye!